Eleven Media. Today I'm doing something that's a little different. I wanted to give you guys an idea of what we use for equipment behind the scenes when we're doing some of our video shoots when we're on scene. Um, this is the DJI Rolling Cam. Now I love this gimbal. This thing is just a beauty. Um, and then I put my, uh, it's the Canon T7i uh, digital camera on there for filming for video. Uh, works great as a combo. I've got my road mic and my screen up here so I can see what's going on. The problem with it is, is that it gets heavy and it may only weigh like 10, 12 pounds or whatever it is, but you know, over an extended period of time, when you're holding it out filming, you start drawing your elbows in, it gets heavier and heavier and it's hard to hold. Um, and so I found a video link and I'm going to put it in the description below for you, where a fellow made this awesome do it yourself, uh, gimbal support carrying device. And all he used was Moly 2, which is the uh, US military uh, rucksack frame, some shoulder straps for the Moly 2 and kidney belt, and then some uh, fiberglass tent poles, airplane cable, some carabiners, and you're done. Now, all in, I think I spent about 225 Canadian for the whole setup. Uh, to buy one of these that are professionally made to, to support a camera rig like this, you're easily six to $700 starting point, and that's US dollars. Uh, and they can easily go well above a thousand. So to do it on this budget was awesome. What I love about it is, check this out. I'm gonna show you something that I think is the coolest thing of all. Look at that. Totally supported by this, the, uh, the tent poles. I'm not carrying any of the weight. It's all transferring through the frame and the, and the straps. And that means that all I'm having to do is control my direction of the camera on the thumb grip up here and basically guide the camera as I'm out filming. Means I'm gonna last a lot longer on set and it's a lot easier. Now I'm gonna turn and I'm gonna show you what this looks like. So pretty cool. I mean, <laughs> bit of a Frankenstein, but that makes it even cooler to me. You know, it's, it's one of these things where you make it yourself, but my goodness, it's super functional uh, and I'm digging it. So anyways, I just wanted to let you see what this is all about and <laughs> The fact that I can feel confident in trusting this, these tent poles are going to be solid enough um, and hold this gear, because this was a few thousand bucks sitting here, uh, I'm, I'm very, very comfortable with that and it's going to make filming a lot better. Anyways, just wanted to give you a little behind the scenes clip as to what we use for some of our camera gear and we'll probably do some other stuff later. We also use the uh, Glidecam Smooth Shooter, which is the vest with the articulated arm or whatever. We got a lot of different gear and we'll probably give you some spotlights on that later. But in the meantime, if you're wanting to build one of these, I totally recommend it. This thing is awesome and it's gonna be a lifesaver for me for filming. Anyways guys, take care, thanks for tuning in. If you like this video, please click like. Also, please subscribe, hit that little reminder bell so you don't miss any future segments. And thank you very much for your support. Talk to you guys soon. Take care.